what's up everybody thank you so much for watching ben travels tv and coming up next on the final episode three of three visiting my family in new orleans louisiana we head to suburbia west side new orleans as we tour the neighborhoods cities and see all what the west side has to offer we also head to midtown for a little bit of ice cream and also a little bit of pastry tasting can't go wrong with the gelato either we also tour the luxurious neighborhoods and mansions and estates on the west side we also take a stroll past the saints and pelicans practice facilities and you can't go wrong with lake pontchartrain as we also do some gator watching <laughs> all right you guys welcome back to my channel hit the like button hit the subscribe button i would truly appreciate it now all good things must come to an end this is the final installment of the series episode three of three i am the last one standing my younger brother my younger sister and my aunts have all flown back to their prospective homes it's just me my mom my dad left here in new orleans with my brother and you see my niece there and his family so we are actually headed to have some breakfast in river ridge at dots diner i will check back in with you guys in a little bit enjoy the video man my focus has been bad Man, I don't know what's up with my settings. There we go. You just a lot after you in school, huh? What? You put chicken waffles. How y'all doing? Coffee? All right. Can you get right behind your Alright you guys, we just finished eating a delicious breakfast at Dot Diner in River Ridge. Now, I forgot to press the record button and I thought I was recording so I didn't have any footage of the plates we were eating. Absolutely delicious. Um, now, so we stopped by Bro Market really quick and uh, we were just driving around, just taking a tour of the neighborhoods on the west side. So the Mississippi River is really close by. And on the west side of New Orleans in the suburbs, we're going to be pretty much giving you guys a driving tour of Elmwood, Harahan, Kenner, Metairie, Jefferson. We'll also head into Midtown. We'll also head up north past New Orleans City Park to Lakeshore Park and Lake Pontrahan where we'll drive around. We'll also spot a gator in the lake as well. And that's something that is common on the southeastern part of the United States. Okay, so I should have been gone with the bunch. The previous day but i'm here an extra day because i flew spirit airlines the worst decision i ever made it was a cheap flight so i took the bite and it was my last flight ever with spirit when we got to the airport 
the flight was canceled <laughs> and they just let us all know while we were there and it was quite the spectacle to see how pissed off people were but anyways ended up staying an extra day i took another airline and i did not want anything to do with spirit ever again so i've never flown spirit since then never will and i will not recommend probably the worst airline but anyways you guys enjoy these beautiful homes if you're ever thinking about living in new orleans or getting an airbnb or a vacation home or retiring here this is definitely the place to do it i'll check back in with you guys in a little bit uh, i show you all these, all these houses in here stucco yeah this is this stucco. house is stucco they have a few stuckles it's about five hundred thousand dollars over here man. that's not bad for five hundred now this is not bad for five hundred I'm 500 is too much for me. What is that? A $3,000 payment? I don't like how they only put like six houses in it. See, I like big driveways. There have you a bunch go. Of, uh, houses that want I, like this is it. I like the driveways in the back in the garage. You don't have. Like, I wish I had a back garage. Houses. It's just like ten houses on one block. That's it. That's better. We've got all these cars and people everywhere. You can actually, your kids can yeah, play like up and down. That's all, that house is all like that. Um, stuck over right there. That's stuck. But they can't get over here stuck over here by a shopping center. That's the one. Is that ain't stuck over It looks like brick. That ain't brick. Uh, brick, it's all uh, brick. This is brick. It's a concrete, I mean. Yeah, it's a mixture of concrete stuff. It ain't a stuck or stuck or like California. It's more like concrete stuff. look down here, you're going to see some houses. That's what some basketball players live down here. That's a nice house, big driveway. Brick. Yeah, they got a barn back Look there. This. Yeah. These houses go for the fives? This one probably go for a million right now. So where Drew Brees live? No. Oh, Drew Brees live in, you said down new, oh yeah, in the mid city. Everybody knows where his house is? Yeah. Well, we were on the trolley by this, we went by Tulane and all that. Uh, people be trying to go up to his house? Like Kobe's in Newport? Kobe Bryant, they be on YouTube. They like give you like peace and quiet out here, they don't bother people like that. LA, yeah, Kobe had to. You don't have paparazzi and all that crap. Okay. Yeah, Kobe's house in Newport Coast, that's you could drive people, up on it. That's why people like it out here, because you can live a regular life and have money and be a celebrity, no one can. Like Drew Brees on they walk around on the first corner. With them crazy with they, fans? They, and everything, they won't say nothing to Drew no. Brees? What? They just say hi, and they say, who that is? Go I thought the Nick, uh, what was his name, Lane Kiffin said that he can't go nowhere. He said in Alabama, he can't go nowhere. He said uh, the basketball player, the football team, and everything. He know? said he can't even go to the grocery store in Alabama that they're too know, popular. That's, that's different, man. I don't know over here it ain't like that. But they got him living in our neighborhood. Like, what's his name? He lives, lives on our street. Uh, uh, he was a wide receiver for, for like the Saints for a long time. Henderson? Devery Henderson? Henderson lives on He's our from street. LSU, man. Yeah. Devery Henderson. I remember at LSU had all you those players. Devery Henderson, Jay Odell they Beckham. See him, they see him all the time. Odell Beckham and uh, Jarvis Landry, all of them there. Now Jarvis Landry, Odell Beckham on the same team, and they were the same team in college. That's a community pool, like you talking about. Yeah, like this. This is what we used to go to. Yeah, we used to ride our bikes, go for the whole day, don't come back till like three o'clock every summer. I need to get this like a snowball. Y'all ever heard of those? Snowball. Never heard of a snowball. No. A snow cone. Snowball. No, what is that? It's like this snow cone. Oh, it's a snow cone. It's a snowball. Snowball. Snowball's totally different than a snow cone. Oh, it is. What is it? It's like a whole different thing. It's a icy, right? With no, liquid. Way better. But it's ice, ice liquid. No, it's not like shaved ice. ice. Shaved ice, right? No, it's shaved ice, but it's shaved. It's thinner. not the crunchy kind. It's not the, crunchy. Oh, uh, it's real like that. It's more of the uh, uh, snow cone type. You know, the snowballs, like, remember the uh, icy ones? You can put ones? ice cream in it. Yeah. It's the different type of ice. Oh, okay. Really ice. They still it's feel, real they thin. They still the same thing. But it's more like snow. You know how snow yeah. is polished it is the way snow is. Oh, it's just all the way shade. It's yeah, not crunchy. Yeah, it's not crunchy. Yeah, this reminds me of Georgia. This is 
Caravan right here. They remind me of Atlanta, like in Kennesaw and all that. What you say? It's the Caravan area. This is like right, right, right up the street from my house. You could do good with a small business out here. If you open up your own little... Uh, yeah, that's exactly this is a nice park right here. Walk through it, it takes you all the way through. I'm used to park Vegas. That's all we have is parks. So we got some real nice parks. All we got is nothing but parks. There ain't nothing else to do in Vegas but go to parks. It's a pretty big minor league stadium. We just built one in Vegas. We got the Oakland A's stadium. They act like it's the best thing ever. Like, dude, I've been going to minor league games since I was a kid. I don't even. Saturday. Well, maybe. Yeah, this is. Yep, that's the Marlins. Oh yeah, I'm getting a video right now. And then they got the practice facility for the other two teams, for the Pelicans and the Saints. These are all the workers here. Probably is. Yeah, we're gonna put a peep in the park. Unless they got an auction going on. Look like a car auction. Looks like all the same cars. Yeah, look, it's probably a car auction going on. They just did a quick car auction. Yeah, a bunch of Hondas. A good little place to go running. Walking. What mom needs to be doing, walking like this. Yeah. Yep, she need to get her headphones. So go walk. You want to get a camera too, Jada? Yeah. Yeah, see, Ty, she get her a camera so she could start doing her vlogging and everything. You could get one for like 300 bucks. Pelicans. Pelicans practice. No, you could get a good one for 300. Practice facility. Because the owner, mom, I take video. <laughs> I'm taking video. This is their practice facility. They let y'all watch practices? Open practice and all that? That's cool. Like the San Diego Chargers we used to go to? Yeah. I used to do that. Remember in San Diego? We used to always go. We saw Seau. He was on the Chargers. Y'all went? Y'all going tomorrow? We ain't gonna be here tomorrow. That's where the church is, man. You on a football team? Just, we just play. Like, like a flag football. <laughs> Sometimes they tackle me. You like me, catch everything, they tackle me. To stop you. That's a nice house. They're from Virginia. You don't like the uh, two stories? There's a lot of rooms and I'm scared. Too many empty rooms. <laughs> I love two stories. 
someone either fix it up or they may keep it like that. I'll show you a spot they got like, this is just like regular living over here. You can tell you see nothing. We get to the other side, you also see some awesome. They're kind of like down in Vegas. Yeah, there's no, tree. They're kind of sectioned off in Vegas. They have one house after another. Oh, yeah. They don't have a yeah, that's too big. Street and it'll be, yeah, That'd be a tree to get hit by lightning and fall on your house. I know trees been there forever. These old trees? Yeah. They've been there for like a hundred years. They're yeah, super strong. They're going to split of lightning in This is new construction. Oh, this one right here. We're about to build another one right here. Someone that bought this spot, they probably tore down a house. Man, that's a tiny lot. How much these houses go for? These New Orleans are expensive. Here you're talking about a million dollars in old town. A lot of these houses ain't over. They put like over a million. Man. This spot. They got some over here about 15, 20 million. There New Orleans yeah. expensive. This, is, this community right here is like old money. It looks like Pasadena. Like, and like having money all day, like, like rich, rich. Back up in where? Where is those houses at? Where is those? So they got a bunch they gotta get over. You can drive through? Uh huh. Oh, they ain't shut in? The ones in uh. You do something though, you can please be there like in less than a second. Oh, uh, what was it uh, <laughs> back in um, that uptown? They had a. Uptown got a lot of like that too. They yeah, have a uh, closed in. Yeah, Some of them are out. Now these are nice. Here. She can start getting down. I can see none of them are 15 May yet. Well, that'll be a big, huge estate. Oh, Berkshire Hathaway is out here. They everywhere. Yeah, you got gardeners all over up oh, the block. The, real, the major real estate companies are the same everywhere. Oh, every city. Oh, the streets like this. Uh, split you in half. The middle with the landscape, and the trees, how they are. They got the branches along over. This here. reminds me of Atlanta. Yeah, it's like Alpharetta. And this is trees like Alpharetta. Like Alpharetta they, like this. They, they may not have the same like type of trees. Yeah, they don't got they, these trees. They don't have these kind of trees, but they, the way this neighborhood is laid out. It's like Alpharetta. This almost. is like Alpharetta. The houses look the same and everything. Yeah. They got all those mansions and they got yeah. all of them in the little street line. It's just like this. Same style homes and everything. This one's for sale. These are ten million dollars? Not big. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah, I'd like to see the ten million dollar ones if you can see them. It's amazing you can go and see a ten million dollar house without it being eaten. Oh, that's a brother. We got a lot of brothers. I don't give us some money. Oh, that one's different. They're probably more contemporary. See, this is more contemporary. That's more French. Up in here. That's a nice house right 
big ones. They still ain't got no money. Man. This is a nice house right here. That reminds you of Florida like right this here. This one here, if I'm being that is looking at that's yeah, probably about it. like like it goes all the way connected yeah. down here. This is where they start getting bigger. All right, yeah, nice uh, pool. They don't allow you to build brick wall backyards, huh? That's why I notice it's just fences. They don't let you do uh, brick. Block. They don't do no block walls out here. Yeah. Because, uh, why? Hurricanes and stuff. Fifteen million dollar houses sitting on the street. They all gave it. Right you don't see them. You see them from a I'm distance. Right that ain't fifteen million dollars. It's more like five. Pretty big. Pretty big. They got their own little garden. Or their yeah. cut. Oh, this is something That's else. That's a nice contemporary one, but look how they built it at the top. That's a big one now. Look at this. That's about five. Like eight. this. I don't like that French prediction style. This one's nice, but it's going to be too gaudy inside. <laughs> how far nice all this ain't go? They just ain't got no land. That's the only thing. You got a lot of Mom, land. there's a lot of land. <laughs> how much land do you want? No, that ain't a, you got a house that big. I don't want all the land. land. I'd rather have less maintenance. Look, that's how they are in California it's too. Look at this one. This they looks have like, a... like this one right. Look at that. Yeah. Four yeah, floors high. That was high. the Spanish style right there. This. Yeah, this one right here. Yeah, that one's cute. Oh, I like these streets. I get sold on the street like this with the tree yeah. covering the shade, just driving through. Yeah, it looks cool. Mm -hmm. I think if it's hot over here and it's yeah, not even, like don't feel as hot. Look at that. Now, you tell me that ain't no $15 million? That ain't no $15 million <laughs> house. That ain't no $15 million house. Mm -hmm. If they paying $15 million for that. Yeah, look how far back it goes. Yeah, yeah, that ain't $15 million, though. Look, That's more let me like show you something. Million. Hold on. Let me show you. $5 million. Look, what about look at this, this one. one. Look at this one. You gotta look at the stuff that it's made out of. Yeah, I am looking at it. It's not it's made, made out of regular, like. Stuff. I know, it's just block. No, that's like made out of different. That's probably a $5 million Character house. and stuff that is. Yeah, got. that's probably a $5 look million this thing. Dollar house. I was gonna say, are you going on that street? Oh, it's showing you. Look. look at this, is this part of it, right? Now mm -hmm. look at the side. I know. Look at it. But that ain't 15 million. Probably like seven. It's in the day, they owned it. Maybe like, five. Ain't none of the this 15 million ones be on the coast. Yeah. The 15 million ones. Like the Michael there. Jordan, uh, Derek Jeter. Yeah, you, they're huge homes for 15 million. That's a lot of money. Yeah, they'd be like uh, them 50 cent Mayweather right mansions. Right here is expensive, if they charge that much money to if live in the houses, they get rich. All right, you guys, we are headed towards Midtown, the central part of New Orleans. And I love the trolleys. It reminds me of San Francisco. And I love the history, the architecture, the homes the southern charm that this city has. Absolutely beautiful, right up against the Mississippi River, tons of lakes, very swampish down in the bayou. So we're gonna head and, and get some gelato and some ice cream, and then we'll finish off at Lake Pontchartrain and Lakeview Park. I'll check back in with you guys in a little bit and enjoy the rest of the video.
La Brisa. Okay, yeah, I see y'all got the spots. Them is the spots to go eat if you want Mexican food right here, Ty. Yeah. Yeah, you seen something? That's what they say. They might. I've been there with a kid bunch of ducks and they don't show up. Right. Yeah, they don't show up. Alright you guys, welcome back and we are at Lake Pontchartrain and it was a little bit windy so I apologize for the wind. Just enjoying my last day in New Orleans before I head back to the west coast. Now this was a popular port for trade for the indigenous 
all right our aboriginals the original indigenous americans much love to you out there who still know the real history of the united states my mom's side of the family is cherokee and blackfeet nation and they come from the descendants of american mound builders that trace back to the aztecs the olmec the incas and the mighty mayans so shout out to my indigenous niji all the way across to the pacific ocean shout out to all my brothers and sisters from turtle island all right you guys enjoy the rest of the tour i'll be back towards the end Yeah, he went under. He's trying to get them ducks. Man, that was a big one. You be swimming in here, Ty? I know. They be, oh, look at Look at them. He's swimming now. Oh. Man, he crazy. Someone about to get ate by an alligator. He stood up from his tail. You want to touch it? No! I can't. No. You want to wash no. it? You want to wash it? Huh? Yeah, it is crazy. Yeah, there you go. Come on. 
want to walk or want to walk exercise. This is where I turn around. I turn back here. Those girls are too strange. I like to walk around the ocean. Family garden. If we live in New Orleans, this is where we have to come. It's nice, cool. Get one of the barbecue something. The seafood house right here. This is probably fire because it's right on the ocean. Yeah, take my dad. Yeah, I'm sure that's good. Yeah, that's nice. It's always crowded. This is you can see the car. Crowded. Don't you see food out? They got the blue crab. Oh man. Whoa. All you can eat. Yeah. All you can eat. Oh, Next that's time where I should have been living. If I live here, they will see me in there. They will know me. Mm -hmm. I said you can get in the door. Yeah, I have to get in there. I have my time there so I can get in. I love the buffet. I love the buffet. Wow, look at it. Get the best seafood over here. That's all I'm saying. See the crab. Man, Ty, you should have took us here. Whoa. Like oysters. Man, wow. I'm sure they got uh, See, crab. The this is like a savannah area by the seashore. Man, next time this for girl, sure. This is the nice area. Man, next time for sure. This is yeah, I need to be. I know. I would have came down here and had crab legs. Huh? Right? Model you S. You eat too much. You have to drink. Yeah. Nice. This is nice, man. What's that? Come on, we can't go get a boat and just go chill. They only be like 400 bucks, I'm sure. I don't know about out here. Dang, rent a boat, probably like $200 a day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Beverly Hills. Yeah, they are rich people. Some people come from New Orleans. That we have this girl live. Uh, what is her name? That uh, yeah, that boy. She take care of by Lakeview. Uh, what is that one that you can have this in? It's a Lakeview. Yeah, they are no the only. Brad Pitt. Then they move. Pitt. They have houses Brad Pitt here. But they have a they house. Here. Sandra Bullock. The uh, uh, what's his name? Matthew McConaughey. McConaughey live in Texas, don't he? Oh, he does. Yeah, a lot of celebrities yeah. live on the French Yeah, a lot of those uh, Hollywood people. Uh, they, they, they like New Orleans. It's a lot of Serena, too, there. have house, yeah. A lot of Serena? I thought they live in Hollywood. They like, they like uh, this place. Yeah, they're floating, don't you? Serena have a house. Yeah, but she has a house all around. She had uh, she's, now that oh she's yeah, married, she's, she's selling them one by one. She sold the New York man.
trees, you know. It makes me feel like I'm in Nigeria, Lagos. The trees? The trees, yes. Yeah. Yeah, the trees are old metal. Yeah, we got fruits on the uh, uh, trees. Mango, I should take them by them houses we went by, right? You know, we be going to school, they be three percent. Huh? You should have that's how you miss out on stuff. Yeah, it's okay. Now you miss a lot of stuff. Yeah, that's okay. The one I like best is by the lake. I like the riverside. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that one I like most. You know, walk around and see the water. Mm -hmm. yeah. Next time we come down, we're going to have to go to that seafood the, place the, uh, and get a boat. That's what bring all the kids, now bring everybody. I do. That's the thing, Ben and I mean, Isaac and Faith don't like seafood. They act like they can't eat seafood. They don't. Faith they will eat. Faith eats sushi. So I never try to choose somewhere to just have seafood because for them. Isaac and you don't fish. Yeah, he don't like seafood. I know Isaac don't like seafood. He don't like fish. He don't like crab, shrimp, none of that. I can eat some grilled fish, some baked fish, I don't like fried fish. And, uh, I don't like fish. I eat no I like fish. I like the salmon they got over there and that mahi mahi fish. Oh, the mahi mahi like is halibut. fire. Have you remember yeah, that halaba? Halaba is expensive more than salmon. So I, mean, I like halaba, no, but it's, it's too expensive. It's like the, it's like the fish. If I eat fish, I like yeah, it fried. Yeah, fish stick. It's a fish stick. Give me some fried and give me some grilled shrimp and some crab legs. I used to much crab when I'm growing up, so I don't I like, like crab. Lobster. Lobster is just like a crawfish without even the flavor. Yeah, See, like crawfish has a flavor that makes it better. Yeah, crawfish do taste. Uh, I has a good taste. Like but I'm not eating them like that. So Take the meat out. It's just like a, a craw. I mean, a, I lobster. Tried. a yeah. baby lobster. I tried. But it has a. But it has all the seasoning. When I eat crawfish, I have to wipe off the crawfish. Oh, yeah. no, you, drink, like you drink coffee? Yeah. No, she said crawfish. Co oh, crawfish. Yeah, because they have all that little ready stuff. So you stop us, like. All them group texts. I be muting that. Man, I can't stand that group text. All right, you guys, all good things must come to an end. And as I told you earlier, Spirit canceled my flight. So I was in New Orleans for an extra day. I can't remember if I flew JetBlue or Frontier, but I ended up getting a connecting flight for, to Denver International Airport. And I would have a three hour layover that turned into a five, five hour layover. As you can see, it was very cloudy and overcast, wet and rainy. That ended up turning into heavy snow. So I stayed a few extra hours while they cleared off the runway. They dried it off and dried off the plane from freezing. <laughs> so and then we took off over the Rockies and back to Las Vegas. So I just wanted to speak about my trip in New Orleans and the times I've spent there over the years. I would say definitely if you're going to visit New Orleans, Louisiana, definitely spend about a week. So that way you can really appreciate the history, the culture, the food for sure some of the best food that you will get in the united states there's so much fun at the french quarter the river walk 
uh, also Bourbon Street. You can head to the suburbs. There's also other places and other things to do like museums. They have the Jazz Fest there, Mardi Gras. There's so much that goes on in New Orleans. Definitely pick a good time to make your trip outside of New Orleans, even up to Baton Rouge. If you want to catch a football game at Louisiana State University, you want to check out one of the plantations to dive into a little bit of the history. You want to go fishing. You want to go check out some gators. So much to do down in the bayou in the southeastern part of the United States, right up against the Mexican Gulf. But anyways, guys, I'm going to keep dropping videos until the end of the year. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. I'll see you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching. I'm out.